front of all the media? Not necessarily. I ask real nice. <laughs> well, if that doesn't work, he also has a dressing room backstage. Seems to me a man like Taggart must keep close track of his employees. Speaking of which, I also backtraced that breach in our own firewall. The one Sarov opened but forgot to tell us about. The PI. I was using right before he hired me. Right. Mm. Looks like our <sighs> boss was being chatty with a private detective named Brent Radford. He lives on Earl's Court. In case you want to get chatty with him too. Uh. Now what I want here is to see if we got more Praxis. And some hypostims. Hypostims are always good. Jennifer Klugman. What? Interesting. Will you be purchasing anything today? Yes, yes. Oh my God! Two more praxis. Holy crap! Find the hypostims. What am I even doing with this? Could get more batteries, which again, as you know, don't regenerate. Um, like the, the only, only the first one regenerates if you use a whole battery. The other ones will regenerate if you only use partial. Could get a cloak. It's a nice oh shit button. What the hell, why not, right? What else am I doing? Um, okay. I'm gonna go say what up to that private detective that found out I was adopted. <laughs> which was back in Mills Court, which is, of course, where I came from. So, thanks a lot, Francis, for waiting tell me I appreciate it like you're obviously tracking me via GPS you couldn't have just told me when whatever 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 up here This is where Double T was. Double T Diner, if you remember. I see a bad guy on the map. Oh, right. This. Place been ransacked. What's up, dude? <laughs> Search the apartment before I uh, talk to the critically injured man. And Jensen comes first. Jensen, oh, Christ, Brent Radford in the. Flesh. For now. How do you know my name? What happened here? Answers for favors. There's a, a trauma kit I keep somewhere around here. Find it. You need a doctor. I'll get help. No. No time. The, they could be back any minute. Find I'll the kill kit them quickly. If you want answers. <clears throat> Alright. I'll be back. He doesn't say shit to you until you get it, so. Normally I would just torture him for information. Did you find the kit? Oh, sweet Jesus. The pain. Morphine. This should help with the pain. Now tell me what's going on. Those sons of bitches. I should have seen it coming. I knew from the moment Saraf got spooked that, that this case would come back and bite me in the ass. Saraf. <coughs> So you're the investigator he hired to run a background check on me? Detective. Or I was, until... Christ, fuck it. 
It hurts and I'm just trying to breathe. Point is, the goons that did this to me, professionals. I think your boss pissed off the wrong people trying to dig up your dirt. What people? What did you find? The no puzzles are very strategic. To go into details. My storage unit, the sons of bitches. They're headed there now. Saref had me uncover a ton of shit on you. Stuff even you don't you don't know. Your parents, your your real parents. The tests, the fire. What are you, Jensen? Some kind of freak? Focus, Radford. I put it all. I mothballed the case in storage. It's in an alley. Behind the bank. Your files are there. But Michelle knows. Michelle knows more. You need to stop. You need to stop them. Stop them. Fuck. You robot. This this is all your fault. Give me give me another shot. Morphine. Or go fuck yourself. Focus, Radford. Ah, that hit the spot. I think I could get used to this stuff. Hey, I'm feeling a little more talkative. Already. Robot. Man, these pauses. They're, they were obviously written. And not, uh... Why did Seraph stop? Never spoken aloud until you said he was spooked. This guy went into the booth to record him. him. You wouldn't <laughs> believe me, even if I told you. <laughs> Hell, even I don't. I still don't believe it. You believe in ghosts, Jensen? Seraph was spooked by ghosts. Close enough. Illuminati, <laughs> conspiracies, theories—it's all bullshit. But you stink of it, Jensen. Enough to have your boss, one of the most powerful men in the world, look away. <clears throat> You're a ghost. A fucking tragedy. Everything you touch, everything that touches you, dies. True enough. True enough. You mentioned someone named Michelle. Who's Michelle? <laughs> Your guardian angel. Who is she? Tell me. Do robots believe... Do robots even believe in angels? Or did they take that out of you? Did they take that away? You know, your soul. When they built you. <laughs> Tell me. He can't speak what in complete senses, like but he can laugh. When you died, Jensen. Laughing hurts. I know you're in a lot of pain. When you have a gut wound. Is Just find her. Before they do. You, you owe her that much. Okay. Who did this to you? Guys in suits. One ah, of them, David specific. or Daniel, something like that. British accent. He was in charge. Talked about a Mr. Mr. Gray. They were in a, a hurry. Four of them. Not counting the one they left behind. Well armed, disciplined. I, I didn't stand a chance. Maybe that metal corpse you call a body will do better than mine did. Well, yeah, I can kill for? four guys. You Don't worry about robot. it. robot. They wanted my information on you. Someone powerful has their eyes on you and is very interested in your past. Okay. Radford, I know you're in a lot of pain, but it's important you give me as many details as you can. There's a storage unit in the alley next to the bank near the police department. That's where the suits are headed. I tried. Didn't give them anything. There's a safe. It has what you want. It'll get you to her. It'll lead you to her. To Michelle. The safe. They don't have the, the right combination. Four, zero, six, two. Remember. Yeah, I could have just hacked that anyway, but thanks. Me to help? Take whatever you want. From here or the storage unit. There's a weapons cache. And some money. There. <laughs> money. There. Well, I'm done. I'm leaving. But I'll call in an ambulance. You'll be okay. 